It's my favorite time of the month. Time to give a special shout out to the awesome people at the Fabled Survivor Tier. You can join the Fabled Survivor Tier on YouTube or Patreon. Links are in the description. It amazes me how much you guys do for me and my family. We really do appreciate it. Me, Autumn, Sylvie, and Sammy, love you all very much. You people rock. What's up, Zombie Slayers? Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is kg 4 e and welcome back to 7 Days to Die Alpha 21. I want to buy some experience potion thingies, but I don't have enough money. There we go. Now I have enough money. All right, we're going to go out and do a tier 5 infestation quest, and then when we're done with that, we're going to go work on the horde base. I really have to start working on the horde base. I'm having a really good time doing these quests, though, so it's, it's hard for me to pull myself away, but we do have demolishers coming this horde night. And we need to be prepared. So uh, let me go ahead and eat right now while I'm thinking about it. There we go. Let's go ahead and grab something to drink as well. Beautiful. And we are going to be doing the quest at... Where is it? Joe's Junction. Should be a lot of fun. I did scout it out ahead of time. It's definitely a quest I've done before, but it's been a while. Um, like I said last episode, it's going to get to the point where we've done, all the, we've done all the POIs. But I'm just trying not to do the same ones too often in a row. And this, this, this is a pretty cool POI, so we'll check it out. When we're done with that, we're going to come back, and I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to work on the Horde base for the second half of the video. And uh, what are we on, day 47? Horde night will be here before we know it. So let's get on out here, and let's let's do some questing. This thing feels slow. Why does this thing feel so slow? Oh, goodness. Okay, well. Oh, I'm just hitting everything. All right, well. Stupid fog. <laughs> stupid fog. I'm going to blame the fog. Yeah, we'll go with that. I got a lot of repair kits. I can make even more. It shouldn't be that big of a deal. Here we are. I think there's going to be a dog at the beginning of this one. So this is a sit-up-in-the-chair situation, if I've ever seen one. Uh, where's the mutts? Where's the mutts? Come on, you freaking mutts. All right, I don't know. Maybe there is no dog. thought there was. Maybe it's inside. You never know. All right. I don't like the way the fog is inside, so I'm going to get rid of it in a moment. I'm here to, like... All right. You know what? You're done. I'm here to make the game look as good as possible. I want you guys to be able to see a clear picture. I don't mind the fog being in outside, but when it's inside, it kind of annoys me. So if you want to get rid of fog, you just do weather... Fog zero. There you go. Now, doesn't that look prettier? Fun Pimps, you want your game to look good? I mean, you, you go through all this, like, you go through all these headaches to make your game look good, and then you wash it out with fog. You know? I don't, I don't get that. Oh, there you are. Yeah, let me help you out there. There you go. Help you to hell! Again, I forgot to take my medicine. Of course I did. Those of you who don't know, if you're new to the game or whatever, you yeah, have been paying attention. I take one thing of vitamins because it does keep you from getting infected. And I usually take two experience drinks. And that that'll that'll take that'll last me the whole the whole POI. Okay. Those experience drinks are pretty cool, man. I never I never used them back in the day. Like they've been in the game for a long time. I just I don't know, I never used them. And um you should. I mean you really should. Locked. Gotta go up this way. We got up here. Nothing in there. Get some tools. Scrap that. And scrap that. It's a box. Okay. Is there any zombies left in this place? Or did I kill them all? Unless those are zombie snakes. One zombie on this whole level. Okay. They're probably all going to be up here. What's up, bro? Really? That's it? Oh, I hear something else. I was going to say, this is an infestation, isn't it? This place is not very infestation infested 
Wake up! Hmm. Okay then. Ooh, book pile. I almost didn't see it. I usually just read these for the experience. I don't I don't need that much. I got like a billion freaking dukes. Okay. I'm supposed to go out here outside the window. Down here. And oh. This is where I've already come through. Okay, so where am I supposed to go? I'm not supposed to go this way, right? Nah. Not that way. All right, definitely this is the way to go for sure. Brought us up to here. Oh, okay, here we go. Whenever I see somewhere leading outside, like outside a window, I'm like, oh, that's where I'm supposed to go. I've been trained, you know? Dude, where the hell is everybody? Oh my goodness. This is ridiculous. Supposed to go this way? I don't think so. Mm. Finally, some zombies. A lot of them. But it's not going to be enough. Up by a damn sight. Oh, okay. All right, that was, okay, that was good. That was a good trap. That was a hell of a good trap. That could have killed me. I don't know what just, oh, I stood on the campfire, that's why. Yeah, that could have killed me very easily. Very easily, I just, got, I kind of got lucky, honestly. I don't think I would have died, but I, I would have taken a lot of damage. And then I might have panicked and died. Yeah, so that's what you need, man. You need, like, you think the zombies are coming from this way? No, they're going to trap you. Oof, that... Good job. That was a good job. I don't even I don't even know where they came from. Did they spawn up there and drop down? That's what I'm thinking. Okay, I'm probably supposed to go down that way. Stupid thing. I don't think that's the way I'm supposed to go. Oh man, there's like three, four different directions I can go. Well, this is where the light's telling me to go, so this is where I'm gonna go. Okay. Oh, medicine. And more grandpa's elixirs. That's what they're called, right? Uh, yeah, grandpa's learning elixir. In there. Oh, never mind. There is something here. And more healing. Oh, that's the way I came in. All right, so I went down that time. Let's go up this time. This is the uh, roof that, yeah, this is the same roof up here that the ladder that came up. I think the zombies spawned up here and then dropped down on me earlier. I'm pretty sure this is where they came from. Okay, fair enough. Go back down here, and I gotta try and get up this rope. Yeah, good luck with that. I don't think so. Actually, never mind. Oh, wait, am I supposed to go down, or was I supposed to go up? I've been here before. Yeah, so that goes up. 
I'm not really sure where I'm supposed to go. Okay. Oh, hold on. I could probably break through on the other side, right? Or not even, you don't even have to break through. There we go. Armor. Okay. I'm not sure where I'm supposed to go. Maybe it's, uh, maybe it is on the roof. Maybe there's some place on the roof. Uh, like up here. I'm not seeing it. Yeah, I'm not really sure where to go. Let me see if I can figure this out. All right, this is that shotgun messiah thing I just looted. There's another way down here, and there's a light here. Yeah, yeah, this is where I'm supposed to go. Hmm. I don't think so, guys. Nice try. I'm not gonna lie, guys. When I see it, when I see a radiated cop, the guns are coming out. That's that's that. Okay, making sure nothing's falling on my head. Did I go outside. Yes. Okay. Let's check in here. Down. I get an abrasion every time. Like I don't think I can get hit without getting abrasions. It definitely doesn't happen on the first hit, but it's like the second or third, it's like boom, abrasion. Anything else over here? Oh, gun safes. Open gun safes. Okay, so now I'm like supposed to go down or am I supposed to go up? There was a way up. Uh, at least I think there No, there was a way out. Hold on, let's take a look at what this is first. Nah, this is just a way out. This isn't anything. Oh, dude, a freaking half pipe? Hell yeah, bro. Oh, I've never skateboarded on a half pipe. I, I've, street, I've skateboarded on the street. Never on a half pipe, though. I'd love to skateboard on a half pipe. Whoa. Yeah. I mean, I did it on Skate or Die and Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 2 on the Dreamcast. Shout out. But, yeah. Ow. Oh. Good job, buddy. Fell it right into the spikes. Oh, I guess he, like, barricaded himself in here and died. Probably was infected. Ow. Alright, let's get where we're supposed to get. Down here. Ooh, okay. That's unlocked. I'm pretty sure that's where I'm supposed to go. So let's double check over here. No, yeah, all right. That is the way I'm supposed to go. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, hold on. I feel like there's supposed to be a lot of zombies in the area. I don't know where they are, though. One? One freaking crawler? Seriously? There we go. That's what I was thinking. Oh, goodness. Okay. Yeah, when they when they start hitting you from behind, you, you gotta take that seriously. Oh boy, dude. Um. All right, this is a little bit uh scarier than I was thinking it would be. Why am I playing like ass now? Ugh. 
that was way, way, way more dangerous than it should have been. Oh, there's still a cop. But I got returned to the trader. Alright, what else? Okay. Uh, did I, I did loot a steroid, so there we go. That'll be for my sprained leg. Wow. That was, uh... That was way, way more dangerous than I... I just... I wasn't taking it seriously. You know? If you don't have the pain tolerance or all the great armor and stuff, that stuff will get you killed. Go ahead and loot this. That's not ammo. Are we full? Almost. Alright. Let me go, uh... Bring stuff up to my truck. And then I'll come down and get the rest of the loot. And... There we go. I'm gonna loot all of these just in case they get blown up. I don't think they will, but just in case. Okay. Alright. Some interesting loot there. And by blown up, I mean because I'm gonna use these. And I'm not gonna wait either. There we go. Nope, that's not gonna work. Okay. I think you're supposed to, if you want to be efficient, you would use these one at a time, by the way. And also, I don't think the explosion can hurt you. I, I, uh, I don't think it can hurt you, but I usually back up just because. Unlock, man. I don't have all day. I gotta go turn in this quest. There we go. And awesome. Let me get my loot for this guy. I'm going to organize and we are going to go out and work on the horde base. So what do you have for me, buddy? Um, your stuff sucks. Just throwing that out there. I will take the rocket launcher and then I will sell you your own rocket launcher back to you because your rocket launcher sucks. I don't need it. I don't want it. All right, now that we're done doing business, get out of my store. Okay, I will. Uh, yeah, let's uh, let me grab everything I'm gonna need and let's go work on the horde base. It's time to uh, start thinking about demolishers. So, demolishers. My big secret on how to defeat demolishers is auto turrets. Now, I don't know if it's changed in Alpha 21, and I don't know if I'm misremembering. It's been a long time since I fought demolishers, but from my memory of fighting demolishers, I believe that auto turrets do not, cannot set off demolishers. Just won't happen. It's not even like, it, it, it just can't happen. Um, the only thing is, I only have three of them. I was hoping they have four. I'll probably take one of these away. I don't really need two of these shooting up at, uh... Wait, do, do I only have one on this side? Hold on. Oh, I only have one on each side. Where do my auto turrets go? I feel like I've lost some of them. Alright, whatever. I'll go home and see if I've got more, but... I don't know, man. I don't think I have any more. So, whatever. I have a couple cages here. Uh, that aren't going to work because I didn't build them up properly. Yep. Okay. So I had a couple cages built here, but they're not going to work because the, um, the, the piece, the bar is taking up the spot where I'd want the auto turret to go. So the bar would have to go down one more spot. So let me see what I can do here. I really need to be getting this fancy. Well, let's take a look. So I could just move it down, then I'm gonna have to break that out. I guess that's fine. All right, I got something I like here. I went ahead and just moved the, basically the bar was taking up this block right here. These bars, these wooden bars were taking up this block right here, but they were on the bottom. They're still taking up that block, but now they're on the top and that leaves room for the auto turret. So I'm gonna want the auto turret to be protected. But that's not going to be easy. Uh, it, it's doable, but it's not going to be easy. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these yeah, like that, like that, like that. Yeah, this is going to be this is going to be a little tough, but I'll get it done. I mean, I don't really need to put this stuff around it. Honestly, I'm just putting it around it because it looks cool. So that is perfectly fine. And then we'll put these on this side. We'll put, uh, copy rotation. Put that like that. We'll just leave that alone. Then copy rotation. Alright, cool. 
and then we just need to put something on the on the uh, outside. I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna do that though. Let's see. Uh. Oh, there we go. Hold on. There we go. Beautiful. Now let's get some stuff and let's upgrade that. And uh, by the way, uh, right now this power is running on 245 or 300. So I can run two more, uh, two more turrets on there and still be under the amount of power I'm allowed. So it will not be a problem. So let's just grab some of this. And let's go ahead and upgrade this. Oh, I got a level. Look at that. I'll upgrade this to concrete eventually, but just that, like, I only upgrade the concrete at the last minute, just in case I want to change something. Now, I do I, I want to put a hatch in here. Well, actually, I really don't need to put a hatch in here. Well, you know what? These are on the outside, so I won't be able to put anything on top the way it is. So what I would need to do is I would need to take one of these, a pole. And actually, can I get a smaller pole? Yeah, I can. I just got to find it. I guess I could use these, these pillars. All right. Uh, advanced rotation. Yeah, just like that. Uh, and like that and now I should be able to put these in on the sides that, that I gotta make sure I can still reach it all right I can reach it from here you know what I'll just leave it open there's no reason not to leave it open there we go come on all right let's just go all the way up to Concrete on this. All right, I'm going to give this thing power. And I'm going to show you how this is going to work. Now, in order for me to give it power, I have to have a switch. The turrets are only going to be on when demolishers come in. So I have to have a switch ready to go. All right. And where will that switch be? Um, I guess I just put it right there. Or right there. You know what? I think right there will be good. So the power will come in from here to the switch. And the switch to the turret. Okay. So let's go ahead and turn that on. And then... Let's make sure it's off first. Yep, that is off. And now it should be on. What did I do wrong? Oh, I see. Well, let's make sure the switch is working then. Turn that off. Make sure this is off. And then turn it on. And I have no stamina because I'm jumping all over the place. And now that should be on. Beautiful. So now what we do is we go right here and we aim it like so. And the idea is, the idea is this turret will be off the entire time. And then a demolisher will come in. And then I will turn on the turret and stop shooting it. At least I won't shoot at the demolisher. Oops, I forgot about that. I won't shoot at the demolisher. I might shoot at the other zombies, but I will not shoot at the demolisher. And then I just let the turret do its job. Again, I could be misremembering. It it could have changed. I, I don't know. But all, all I know is I remember the turret's not setting off demolisher. Now, you guys can tell me in the comments if it's true or not, or you can let me find out for myself. Um, either way is fine by me. <laughs> I, really, I really don't care. Uh, either way. So let's go ahead and set this one up as well. It should be pretty, pretty solid against the... Uh, the demolishers well you know we'll see we shall see i think the next thing i want to do is come through and upgrade these walls i don't even know if these walls are going to work i really don't care i mean if they don't work we'll just kind of have to figure it out um i think they're gonna have to be higher though that's for sure um i think we're gonna do one more day of building here and i will raise these up uh the next day i build a 
I'll finish upgrading all that stuff. I'll get the other turret. Yeah, we need another half a day of building. I don't think a whole day of building board bases is really warranted. Um, so I think like I like the like the one quest line, and then we come back and and work on the horde base type of setup. It seemed pretty pretty good. There we go. It's all looking nice. It's all looking good. And we want to start putting stuff to steal. Hmm. You know what? I think we'll save that for next time. I think we'll save that for next time. Right now, I have a pretty good setup here. Uh, and I think it's going to be pretty good. And we'll have to see. And what is this? Day 40. So by the time I come back, it'll probably be day 48. I think we might just do... I think on day 48, we'll do another quest. And then we'll come back and work on this. I think it'll be a lot of fun. Either way, I am going to call this one here. If you end up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy.